This is the Saucony Ride 10, which won our Best Update Award in the Summer 2017 Shoe Guide. Saucony made some big changes in the shoe. One is they wanted to address the fit, but they also wanted to address the underfoot ride. And one of the ways they did that is they got rid of the heel landing zone, which was a second piece of foam they had in the heel for when you made contact with the ground. And instead they've upgraded the entire midsole foam underneath the foot to a new power foam material. So it's a new improved foam that they're using. They also have the top layer of Everrun still, which is just a single three millimeter thick layer of their really bouncy foam on top of that. So you get a bouncy sensation under the foot. The combination of these changes did make the shoe a little firmer underneath the heel and the forefoot, but it's still plenty soft, gives you a good responsive ride, so it's going to handle high mileage, but it's also going to feel pretty quick when you really want to turn on the speed. And up top, they are using two zones, really. There's an engineered mesh in the forefoot to make that forefoot fit nice and comfortable, and then you get a really secure fit in the heel with this woven textile in the back and the heel counter that's going to lock your heel in place, give you some stability there, and then allow the forefoot to really open up into that engineered mesh zone. The Saucony Ride 10 won our Best Update Award in the Summer 2017 Shoe Guide, and it retails for $120.